Yeah, check out Jake on uh, Twitter. He's been posting all the stories he's been doing since getting down to Los Angeles. And I look, Christopher, looks like 81 degrees tonight for the home run derby and the same about 81 degrees at first pitch in Los Angeles tomorrow. For, yeah, like, the temperature is really warm there, especially as you move just a little bit inland. Those temperatures climbing into the 80s and even some triple digits as you work your way a little bit closer to Palm Springs. We have 80s in our forecast, too, once we get beyond today. It's been a pretty dreary, damp, cloudy start to the day, but we're starting to see the changes out there. Live look over downtown Seattle. You can see the sun kind of mixing in with the clouds right now, and that's boosted that temperature up to 62 degrees. Mostly cloudy skies, but again, some healthy sun breaks starting to develop, and that is a sign of things to come. Most areas in the 60s right now with one or two upper 50s sprinkled in. Good afternoon in Everett, 58 degrees, 64 in Puyallup, 63 down I-5 in Olympia, as well as Chehalis going out to the coast, 63 as you work your way into Hoquiam, that upper level storm system that brought that cloudier, refreshing weather of the weekend, now starting to work its way toward BC and Alberta. You can see the showers and storms associated with it, but we're starting to see our skies clear out. Notice that right over the past few hours, all that cloud cover, the white, the gray area is starting to lessen across western Washington, and that means we're going to see some partly to mostly sunny skies by this afternoon and evening. 6.30 p.m. Notice most areas other than maybe the Olympics start to see those sunny skies out there. That's going to boost the temperatures up, and once we see those sunny skies this afternoon, they're going to stick around into your Tuesday as well as your or Wednesday, not expecting much in the way of cloud cover, possibly cloud cover Wednesday morning early that burns off by the afternoon. And the reason why this upper area of high pressure starting to build in, this is going to allow for the mostly sunny skies. It's also going to boost those temperatures up as well. So we have a lot of nice weather on the way. Once we get beyond uh, the next couple of hours, we'll start to see those temperatures warm up. The Strait, as well as up in the San Juans, we're going to see those temperatures hold on to the mid 60s today. Last day with those temperatures in the mid 60s, moving into northern parts of Puget Sound, the northwest interior around 70 degrees, 71 for Linden, 70 in Mount Vernon as you work your way south, 70 for Tualip as well as Marysville. And as we go down I-5, good afternoon in Everett, 70 degrees at forecast high, a touch toast here in King County, 76 degrees here in Seattle and on the east side, 75 is that forecast high for Bellevue as well as Renton and going on down to southern parts of Puget Sound, 76 for Olympia and Lakewood, a touch warmer in Auburn, 77 is that forecast high and if we're going out to the coast, really not too bad of a day, 66 for Long Beach, expecting some of those sunnier skies by this afternoon, 71 for Aberdeen, typical warmer spot, Vancouver, toasty down there, 81 degrees and you already know what's going to be hot east of the Cascades, look at this, we have 80s and 90s in the forecast. It's about to get downright hot here over the next several days. 90 for the Tri-Cities, a little bit more pleasant in Spokane. 79 degrees is that forecast high. Here we go. Today we see those temperatures boost up. Yesterday we stayed in the 60s. That broke that 70 degree plus streak. We hit 69 yesterday. Today we're going up to 76. We're in the low 60s right now, but I promise those temperatures are going to warm up as soon as that sun bursts out. We're up to 80 degrees on your Tuesday, so it's going to start to get a little warm and above average. 84 on Wednesday. That's going to be the warmest day over the next few days with those sunny skies. We see the temperatures hold on to the 80s for your Thursday, 82. We dip down to 79 on Friday. The Mariners are back. Back home, it's going to be a nice day with those refreshing temperatures and mostly sunny skies. First pitch, I think it's around 710, and we're going to see really nice conditions for the game. Make sure you get out to it, and we hold on to those nice conditions over the weekend. 80 on Saturday, 83 on your Sunday, so going to get a little bit toasty. And looking ahead, we could see some pretty hot temperatures the following week, so we'll continue to have updates on that uh, as we get a little more information on that upcoming heat ridge.